I didn't know it was all lit up underneath. That's really pretty. The Blob. That's the President's Daily Briefers from CIA, Defense, State, wherever they come from today. But that's the Blob, the National Security Vehicles. <laughs> guys good morning after a late night last night i am back on the streets of washington i just saw the vice president arrive at the white house for the first time in about a week she tested negative yesterday and is back in the office and just when she got there joe biden well he went out the other way <laughs> he's on his way to alabama today i didn't get to film his motorcade i was stuck doing dad duty at that time maybe we'll catch him later in the day Anyway, we're walking over the Supreme Court. There's a lot of people out there, as you can imagine, this morning. And I have a hankering for pizza. Not just any pizza, but really, really good, fancy pizza. And you're going to see that today, too. Anyway, let's go explore Capitol Hill while we're up here and see what we can see. Look at those. They're pretty. I don't know what they are. They're pretty, though. And then there's some over here. I don't think these are the same. These are different. Different shade of purple. The tree's kind of yellow. <laughs> now over on my left is the Folger Shakespeare Library. It's uh, been undergoing a multi-year renovation. They're digging pretty much all around it. They're going to build like a sort of like a I don't know what you would call it. like I want to say a basement, but it's not a basement. It's like an outdoor terrace, but it's below ground. Can you have a terrace that's below ground? It's like a basement. <laughs> anyway, if you uh, look up the plans for the Folger Shakespeare Library, you can see what they're up to. This place, uh, it was COVID really delayed their renovations, but uh, eventually they'll get it fixed up. I don't think I ever went to Folger. I went to the other Library of Congress movies, but I didn't really have any need for Shakespeare stuff. Okay. We are getting much closer to the Supreme Court, which has gone to basically full lockdown status. They popped up the uh, car bomb barricades, blocking off the roads on the other side of the Supreme Court. And the police are out pretty heavily equipped with weapons and whatnot. Not the machine guns we saw last time. So someone was asking me what's on the back of the Supreme Court. It's actually artistically pretty. I mean, it's consistent with the front. And there are steps, but I don't think anyone ever goes in back there. I'm not sure. But see, it's all closed off, police and everything like that. So, this is the Supreme Court. This is the side. We're going to go around to the front. That's where all the people have gathered. Oh, it's the guitar guy. He's like singing last night. Oh, 
crazy. So we went over and started talking. Okay, guys, so we're going to walk back over here. So everything you see on the right, everything, that's all media. That's all media. And then about half the people you see over there are media. <laughs> There's a very small number of people actually protesting. So. <laughs> She's protesting. I hope, I hope you're not still here. <laughs> All right. See ya. They're protesting. How many people are going to get fired up by this? Do you need any more photos? Oh, I love Stella. Okay. There's a lot of things help you. There's a child. It looks like Israeli television, Spanish television, Germans in here. So. I just do some chanting and whatnot. There's a few people arguing with each other. Not much. Printing, printing press. Yeah, but I, I think it's yeah, yeah, there's a. <laughs> We're like next for this. Like, why are you not in book lab? Yeah, because I'm never on campus. Next semester. Relatable. Next semester, I'll be my student. Oh, next semester when Nat and I are the intro directors. Yes, it's on my CV. Yes, now every every broad post now is looking at three shelters. Alrighty guys, that was basically what's going on here. They've just closed the road off to traffic. The car comes around the corner. A bunch of high school kids over here checking out the scene. Not what they envisioned on their trip to Washington. They thought they were going to go to the museums. Andrea Mitchell's just finished up her broadcast. She's with NBC. Another senior Washington correspondent. So this is another person. Thank you. Guys, that's the last one. Uh, just because we have a live channel. Okay. You guys want to know one of the reasons I don't come up here very often? It's because all the streets look alike. I mean, they all do. They all have townhouses, bricks, whatever. I don't know where I parked my car. <laughs> We're just going to keep walking until we figure it out. They got some weird stuff here. But we're just going for pizza up here in Union Market. Stalina Pizzeria in the heart of Union Market. One of my favorite places in DC. I don't look like that guy. Second lunch, guys. We're early dinner. 
but why not? There it is. None whatsoever, but it'll be fun. So follow me and well, we'll try something interesting tomorrow. Bye-bye.